Insane Gamers back again with another PBR battle, and today I'm using a fairly old pass that I made, well, <laughs> quite a fair few episodes ago. <clears throat> anyway, if you don't remember this pass, it is a Trick Room team, and this is one of my more, um, well, it, it's it's one of my better Trick Room teams, let's put it that way. It's very, um, strategy intensive, blah blah blah, you know, that kind of stuff. So anyway, I'm gonna lead off with, uh, Mass Magius and Remperos, those are my normal leads. Uh, Slow King is a belly drum. Slow King. I've used him once, and <laughs> Jesus, he did well, but anyway. Um, my Japanese opponent looks like he has a very interesting team. I'm sort of, um, I'm, I'm very intrigued. Anyway, <clears throat> in the old Gateway Coliseum again, which I seem to be getting a lot, because, well, I don't know. So he sends out a Machoke and a Ditto, which is a little bit weird, but anyway, here I was predicting the Ditto to transform into Miss Magius, just because I thought it would. You know, just because it's a more effective sweeper. And, uh, Rampardos here, uh, is gonna use Curse, so... My strategy is to obviously Curse and Trick Room. I mean, that's not exactly very... scientific, I guess you could say, but whatever. So Ditto uses Transform, it must have, like, Quick Powder or Choice Scarf or something. And, um... For some reason, I'm faster than the Machoke, which leads me to believe that this guy actually has an anti-trick room Machoke, which would, which is actually kind of cool, because he, if he knows there's a trick room coming up, he could just send out Machoke and counter it, but I'm assuming that was a misclick, because he was probably going for um, my Rampardos, predicting a Focus Sash, trying to confuse it, and yeah, so I'm just assuming that was a misclick, and not actually him just being stupid, because, you know, he's Japanese and stuff. Anyway, so now I'm gonna Rock Slide, and, um, despite the fact that Nchoke is fighting type, he's still gonna take quite a bit, and, well, that, did the Ditto's dead, I mean, come on, it's Miss Magius, it's, Miss Magius doesn't have very good defenses, and plus I've got a Curse up, and I'm a Rampardos, so, anyway, here comes my Rock Slide, and... Like I said, takes out the Miss Magius quite easily because it's like a witch or something. <laughs> Your hat can't protect you now. Anyway, that's what you get for being a copycat. But like they say, uh, imitation is a form of flattery. So I get a flinch hex on the Machoke, which is kind of funny, but <clears throat> whatever. I take it out with the Shadow Ball, and that's two of his guys gone. Now, out... Uh, what am I trying to say? I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Help! 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 I don't know what I'm trying to say. Um, anyway, out comes a pile of swine, which, uh, is pretty slow, so he probably was predicting the trick room and just sent out some slow guys to try and see what he could do about it. And second out is Cast Form, which is cool because it looked like his Weeping Bell and Cast Form might be like a duo, you know, uh, Sunny Day and all that kind of jazz. Anyway, I'm going to switch out now because I can. <laughs> I don't see why not. Just because my sizer doesn't have bullet punch, that's why I'm switching. Okay, so Rock Slide is obviously going to take out the cast form unless it has a focus sash. And Pile of Swine, it might take out. I don't think it will, just because Pile of Swine has pretty good physical defense. You know, for a not very low evolved Pokemon, it's, it's pretty beastly. So, send out my sizer, just because I can. And uh, here comes the Rock Slide. Just like I predicted, it takes out the cast form because it's a little. What is it? Like a blob of ice cream? <laughs> I don't know what it is. Anyway, um, yeah, it looks, its chest looks very suggestive. Anyway, I get another flinch axe. <laughs> wow, Rampardos. You know, Sizer's the one with the King's Rock. Not you, you have a Focus Ash. This is, um, but anyway, yeah, I'm getting tons of flinch axe, which is kind of retarded and not cool, but oh well, who cares. So basically, this guy didn't get to pull off, uh, in fact, he didn't even get to pull off one attack. Well, he did, but it didn't do anything, because he used a dynamic punch on a ghost type. Anyway, um, so, yeah, I, just to make sure this guy wasn't, like, some PBR noob, I got his pass, and it actually is, like, reputable. His Pokemon are EV trained, and they are pretty good. I guess he, he just got sort of unlucky. He wasn't able to do really do anything there, so. Um, that kind of sucks, but, oh, well, I guess that's how the cookie crumbles. Anyway, make sure you guys check out my Pokemon Black LP, and I'll see you next time with another PBR battle.